For over four billion years, the earth has survived after five mass extinctions. Life truly thrived from stalking and walking to flying around. Evolution has allowed for new niches to be found, with some of these powers greater than the rest. Our quest is to rank them and see which is best. At number five, we have an ancient superpower, electroreception. By using jelly-filled tubes known as ampullae of Lorenzini, animals are able to sense electric fields in water. This electroreceptive ability is almost exclusively found in aquatic and amphibious creatures, as water is a much better conductor of electricity than air. Animals, such as sharks, use electroreception to hunt and catch their prey. This is one truly ancient trait that existed 500 million years ago during the Cambrian period. 410 million year old Devonian lungfish were found with the ability to use electroreception. These vertebrates had highly adapted electroreceptors, however a lack of preservation makes it difficult for us to track their early evolution. Fossil evidence also shows that primitive celiacants from the early Carboniferous, 360 million years ago, also had this superpower. Today, Lungfish and celiacants still use electroreception for prey detection and predator avoidance, along with other creatures such as rays. Did you know? Tropical freshwater fish, teleosts, also use electroreception to communicate and chat with one another. At number 4, we have echolocation, also known as biosonar. Animals, like bats, send out a high frequency sound at a very high pitch that hits off something and bounces back to them, rather like an echo. This allows the creature to hear where its food is hiding. By looking at the auditory region in fossilised bat skulls, scientists have found that bats first started to echolocate during a period known as the Paleogene, around 52 million years ago. Here we can see the fossil Acaranesoteris, a now extinct genus of echolocating bats. Marine mammals, specifically odontocetes, which include sperm whales, dolphins and porpoises, also have the ability to echolocate. They use an organ known as a melon to focus this superpower. Experts believe that fossil evidence shows they evolved this ability 27 to 32 million years ago during the Paleogene, due to the shape of their skulls including traits such as a dense, thick and downturned rostrum. Marine mammals use echolocation to hunt, but they also use it to communicate with one another. At number 3, we have invincibility, a truly super superpower. An animal that's pretty much invincible is the tardigrade. These micro-animals have evolved to survive through dehydration, radiation and temperatures as high as 150 degrees Celsius and as low as minus 200 degrees Celsius. In almost every ecosystem imaginable, the tough tardigrades use a process known as cryptobiosis, where they lie dormant through hostile environments and wake up when their habitat is safe again. Whilst they can persist in these harsh conditions, however, they're also vulnerable to being eaten by creatures. Some tardigrade fossils have been found to be about 541 million years old, originating in the Cambrian period, when some of the first complex animals were evolving. Scientists discovered that their ancient marine relatives, the Arthotardigrata, did not possess these outlandish abilities. This indicates that tardigrades likely evolved the ability to withstand harsh conditions when they moved from the ocean, onto land and into freshwater habitats. Did you know that the tardigrade's ability to use cryptobiosis even works in space? In 2007, two species of tardigrades were sent to space, and some survived for 10 whole days. At number 2 we have camouflage, a survival tactic that only the most powerful can handle. Camouflage is a superpower that allows animals to not only hide from predators, but stealthily catch their prey. The first known evidence of dinosaurs using camouflage is Psittacosaurus, a 110 million year old dinosaur found during the Cretaceous period. The armoured dinosaur, Baryalopelta mark Micheli, also had this ability. Fossils suggest that both dinosaurs likely had dark backs to blend in with the forest floor and lighter undersides to match the direction of sunlight. This is known as countershading and allowed them to hide from tall predators and sneak up on smaller prey. Possibly the most powerful camouflaging creatures of all, cephalopods. Despite their poor fossil record, scientists think cephalopods likely developed camouflaging abilities when they moved into shallower water and lost their shells around 330 million years ago during the Carboniferous period. And coming in as the ultimate superpower, regeneration. This ability allows some animals, like axolotls and echinoderms, to regrow body parts using stem cells. Some species can create completely new limbs and organs. 
Crinoids, a type of echinoderm that looks a bit like a flower but is actually an animal, are especially well known for this superpower, and the fossil record shows they likely have had regenerative abilities since their origin in the Ordovician period, 488 million years ago. Echinoderms, which include organisms like crinoids, starfish and sea urchins, are actually noted for having this ability. Extinct groups of echinoderms, carapods and eocrinoids, from the Middle Cambrian 498 million years ago, even show signs of regeneration. For example, Gogia, a Cambrian eocrinoid, was found to regenerate its brachioles, which were used to capture food and respire. Regeneration has many uses. Today, some starfish, brittle stars and sea cucumbers can reproduce entirely new individuals through regeneration. This superpower is also used to escape danger by autotomizing, which means they purposely lose a body part, such as a tail or an arm, to distract the predator, escape and then they regrow that body part. Animals have evolved incredible superpowers. Who knows if there's more to come? Life always finds a way. What do you think is the coolest evolutionary superpower? Comment below with your answers. And be sure to check out the History of Life channel for more. Thanks for watching!